I am Anduin Rin, and I approve this message. When you asked to meet me at the harbor, I had no idea what you had in mind. This is incredible. I can think of no grander gesture, Lord Admiral. What is her name? It certainly sends a powerful message. May her enemies give her a wide berth, and into the dawn she will sail. Oh, Jaina, may she be as steadfast as my father. Thank you. I welcome all of you to the Alliance. When Sylvanas Windrunner became war chief, I knew we would not be friends. But I didn't want us to be enemies. Then came the massacre in Arathi, and the burning of Teldrassil. It's clear she does not fight for Azeroth. She doesn't even fight for the Horde. She wages war upon life itself. We are so close to ending this conflict and forging a lasting peace. But if Sylvanas uncovers some new weapon that allows her to keep fighting, no. We must discover what she's after and stop whatever madness she seeks to unleash upon us. Another old god awakened. This does not bode well. Our world suffers much as it is. The wound in Silithus. The war. The Alliance stands on the brink of victory, of ending this conflict and bringing peace to Azeroth. Sylvanas sent her champions into that shrine for a reason. She must have discovered something that can shift the war back in her favor. Whatever that might be, she must not succeed. Be ready for me to call on you again, champion. We will stop Sylvanas, once and for all. Our soldiers protect our allies on many fronts, across Alliance lands both old and new. We have gained ground against the Horde, yet many battles still lie ahead. I am curious to see what you have in mind, Lord Admiral.